Happy Sunday, I think. I don't know, it's been so confusing lately because, I don't know, we've just been doing so much stuff and staying out too late. I've gotten like four hours of sleep the last two days. Yeah, it's awesome. Best day ever. Uh, we're not doing anything tonight because we are tired. So, we got a pizza from the Pizza Hut and we are going to eat pizza, watch some Saturday Night Live right now, maybe watch a movie later. I don't know what movie we're going to watch, but we'll figure that out. And just like, whew, relax, chill. You know what I mean? Oh, by the way, it is flipping amazing outside right now. Like, it, what do you say? It's like 72, 77 maybe? It was 70, no. It's 73 in the house, so I had to, of course, put on a hoodie because it's cold. And outside, I think it's, uh, I think it's like 76 outside. So it's like just beautiful, perfect weather. Everybody's going to Halloween Horror Nights tonight, and they're like, yay, it's going to be awesome tonight. And we're like, we're not going to that. We prefer sweating and rain. <laughs> Here's my Pizza Hut pizza that we got. We There's... did half pepperoni and half mushroom, so hey, I have the mushroom. Look. Yours looks like way more loaded than mine does. Mine's got like four pieces of pepperoni and yours has like 7,000 mushrooms on it. Yeah, that's how it works. What? But I also added um, red pepper and Parmesan. What do you guys put on your pizza? I'm gonna put some Parmesan on mine. I forgot about that. Yeah, do it. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. What happened to all my cheese right here? I'm gonna, I'm so sad now. Oh no. Oh, and I'm, I have coffee over there too. Yeah, it's right there. There's and a coffee. And we're gonna watch Saturday Night Live because it's, uh, we missed one. It's Sarah Silverman, so it should be funny. This is my relaxing face. Uh, we just watched Saturday Night Live and it was good. Sarah Silverman did a great job, except for the last skit with the Vitamix thing. That was a little bit weird. Oh, I thought it was so funny. Uh, I thought it was kind of funny. We're gonna watch Cabin Fever Patient Zero. It has Sean Astin in it, who's like Rudy, right? Was that Rudy? Oh, I don't know. Maybe? Uh, our neighbor across the street mows our yard, so I had to go outside and pay him really quick because he was outside, and I'm walking outside, and there's a guy walking down the street, and he looks me in the eye, and he goes, excuse me, sir, do you mind if I give you something to read later? And he holds out like a, a church pamphlet or something. And I'm sitting there thinking in my mind about this movie that we're watching, because this is like the most gory movie that we've ever seen. Like literally people's body parts are falling off of them throughout the entire movie. And this guy was giving me like a church pamphlet and I'm like, what just happened? So that movie, super gory, really terrible, very terrible movie. The ending, here's what happened, right? I don't think I'm gonna spoil it for you guys, but I'll I won't spoil it, but I'll spoil it. Pretty much they're like, we're gonna put a twist in the movie, but we're gonna wait to show you the twist until the credits are rolling. That'll get them. And so for whatever reason, they put a twist at the very last second, but they don't explain it to you until the credits are rolling. So it was like, that guy, he's gone now, what? And then they're like, credits. And then like, they start showing it all in reverse, how he, like the entire movie was described in like, I don't know, 30 seconds in the credits. So that's, I mean, that was a bad idea. And it was like his feet were flipping around because he was having dreams. I guess he's not doing it anymore. Right, those? Of course I am. Okay. Oh, did you wake up? <laughs> did you wake up? Look at his little oh, face. Oh, no, bandit. Bean. Bandit, are we annoying you? Bandit. Did we wake you up? <laughs> Let's talk about the movie that we just watched. It was Silver Linings Playbook. Yeah. So here's my honest opinion of Silver Linings Playbook. It won a bunch of awards, right? Why? Really? I mean, hold on. <laughs> let me let me rephrase that. I've seen, the acting was good, yes. It was a good story, it was fun, like laughing and stuff like that. I enjoyed the movie. But, I feel like there were better movies than that. In, in it's like wheelhouse. You know how like every year they get like, like best lead actor or whatever. I feel like there was another movie that happened. Maybe here's why I think that. Because when this movie came out and when it was getting awards, I didn't see anything about it until it started winning awards. Or either it won awards before it even came out? I don't know. All I know is that this movie, I like it because I liked Garden State and I it's like a very similar movie. So 
I I just I like this is the kind of movie that I like, so I liked it. I thought it was really good. Jen loves football now. I don't love football. And actually during that part I was checking my Twitter, so I guess maybe I don't really love football. <laughs> Jen loves football and I love dancing now. That's the way that it goes. Alright, so yeah, it was a good movie. Don't get me wrong, I enjoyed it, but I just feel like there were better movies. I don't know. I think that I Tim know. is like you, I, I don't think that you think like normal people think. Why is that? Because is everybody that? else in the whole world liked that movie. <laughs> so. I'm sure there's one person. Leave me a comment down below if you didn't. I mean, now, I liked the movie. I know that I'm saying like, I, I didn't say that I didn't like the movie. He doesn't get, the reason why Tim doesn't like it is because he can't relate to it because he's like super normal. Oh yeah. You know what I mean? I'm like, not like, I don't like fight people. No, like, but <laughs> I'm just saying like, I don't know. I think you're just too normal for life. Like you're not. You, we did this one time. I had to fill out a thing. This might be not like, this probably isn't normal, but no, I had to fill out a thing and I don't, I don't we know were, who I am. It was for um, the Pivot Head sunglasses and they wanted you to be, they were like, what's your favorite song? What's your favorite movie? And he looks at me and he goes, what's my favorite song? And I go, I don't know. What's your favorite song? So we put happy birthday because he couldn't, he didn't have a favorite song. We like made everything up. It's like, who's your favorite actor? I'm like, I don't know, Tom no. Selleck. No, that's not even what it was. You could not come up with an answer. So you asked me and I gave you ridiculous answers because you should know who your favorites are. Yeah. And it turns out that my favorite movie is Legends of the Fall. <laughs> but that was not true. <laughs> and A River Runs Through It. Yeah. And what else? Bicentennial Man. I don't even remember. Bicentennial Man is my favorite movie. So yeah. that's he. That, my answer was just grandfathered over to him. Because... See, but you know what's great about that is if I were to fill out a form, I could do it for you. Because <laughs> I know your favorite movie. We should do like a favorites tag. Oh yeah, that's like this is like the newlywed game. Yeah, we should right do here. that. Quick, what's my favorite color? It doesn't work like that because then you oh. can just change your answer. Well, I'm not going to change the answer. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. Blue? Yeah, that's right. Okay. See? All right. <laughs> what, what's another newlyweds game question? You asked me one. What's my favorite color? You like orange, but you also like purple. <laughs> so it's hard to tell because like favorite. lately she likes orange, but then it stopped. Like she liked orange like two weeks ago. I still like orange. Now she still likes orange, but it's probably like... I don't know, like... This is the I perfect like time you're... to like orange. It's it's October, y'all. I know, but I like, feel like you're... orange season. I feel like you're more into blue right now. Why? I don't know. You just wear more blue right now. I don't wear a lot of orange. I just like the color orange. Oh, okay. Well, is that your favorite color right now? Yeah. Okay. So I got it right. <laughs> but it has been purple in the past, right? Uh, that's the other thing about Tim is that he like overthinks everything. So <laughs> this game would not really be fun in real life. <laughs> See? Because I you know what I like to do? I like to cover all my bases. I'm like... <laughs> What color do you like? All of them. <laughs> Every color. And here's why. I'm going to give you a detailed reason as to why you like these colors. Yeah. Like, you're actually the craziest. You're not normal at all. Yeah. You like green because one time you wore a green shoe. Here's the thing. I think we just figured this out. <clears throat> Only normal people liked Silver Linings Playbook, so you're the crazy one. Yeah. See? What? <laughs> <laughs> just went outside with the dogs. It is super weird outside right now. No. Cause what's what's the temperature outside right now? Uh, Quick pop quiz. It's 68 degrees outside right now. Totally nice, perfect. The moon is almost full, so it's like really bright. And it's like I don't know what is that? Like if I were a clock, I'd be at like 11 o'clock. So almost straight up, and it's just super bright outside. And then somebody thought it was cold enough to start a fire out there. Ah, uh, you know what I get to do now? Sleep. Joyous, joyous sleep, and it's gonna be marvelous, and I'm going to sleep in like a normal amount. So, <laughs> I like forgot what I was doing just then. I will see you guys tomorrow, and now it's time to pay the price.